inside the journey of a former first lady, Michelle Obama, about to release her new memoir, Becoming, sitting down with ABC's Robin Roberts for a special edition of 2020, airing tonight. What goes through your mind when you read and hear all that's going on right now with this administration? I said what I continue to say. Being the commander in chief is a hard job and you need to have discipline and you need to read and you need to be knowledgeable, you need to know history, you need to be careful with your words. But voters make those decisions and once the voters have spoken, you know, we live with what we live with. Just weeks before that presidential election, a now infamous tape surfaced of Donald Trump talking about grabbing women by their private parts. This is not normal. This is not politics as usual. This is disgraceful. It is intolerable. For Mrs. Obama, the stakes could not have been higher. She writes, I articulated my rage and my fear, along with my faith that with this election, Americans understood the true nature of what they were choosing between. We were now up against a bully challenging the dignity of our country with practically his every utterance. What you haven't said before, mm -hmm. you said, I will always wonder about what led so many women in particular to reject an exceptionally qualified female candidate and instead choose a misogynist as their president. So powerful words. I implored people to focus and to think about what it takes to be commander in chief. It's amazing to me that we still have to tell people about the importance of voting.